Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I'm the author of Toxic Health. I'm here to review this experiment that I'm starting today. And this particular plant is going to be the experimental plant. We're going to look at some plants to give you an overview of why we're doing this experiment. And the first one is this one. And this is a Diphenbachia, has very large leaves. Diphenbachia typically has leaves the size of your hand. And this one is growing very well in my home, which is quite unusual. And the reason for that is because it has a battery powered watch embedded in its roots. And it looks something like that. So it's an analog watch with a second hand. So that watch is giving out electromagnetic pulses every second. And the plant has reacted favorably to it. Now, if I don't do any intervention with the Diphenbachia, I get plants that look like this. So they come into my home looking like this. And then six months to a year later, they have a tendency to look like this. And the reason for that is because my home is filled with radio frequencies. And there's three cell phone towers, approximately 2000 feet to 2300 feet from my home. But a little bit closer are radio frequency transmitting utility meters. And all those radio frequencies appear to be biologically harmful to the Diphenbachia and deform the plant. So I can't grow plants that look like this at my home without serious intervention. And this is quite typical of what my controls look like. So this one's getting filtered water and this one is getting faucet water. As you can see, the leaves are very different. And uh, this one still has sun patterning, but you'll see the leaves are actually glossy. So that's a sign of radio frequency exposure in plants. And much of the patterning is gone. And this one, the leaves are even smaller, absolutely tiny, small, glossy, shiny leaves, very characteristic of radio frequency exposure. So the question is, what happens when you put a digital watch into the roots of a Diphenbachia. So I've actually purchased a digital watch and this watch is going to go into the roots of this plant. And we're going to see whether a digital watch has a similar effect and causes growth like this or whether it's going to cause some other kind of weird deformed growth like these. I'm very, very interested to see if there's a difference between a digital watch and an analog watch. And that was the purpose of this video and this particular experiment. And as soon as I have any more information regarding the results of this experiment, I will do another video. I hope you enjoyed the presentation and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.